So I wanted to paint up my poverty splitter and I was gonna go with black metallic, but I couldn't find any that was made for plastics. Then I came across metallic black stainless from Krylon Fusion meant for plastics and, and uh, other surfaces. So when I read the reviews, it says it comes up as like a charcoal, but I thought I'd give it a shot to see how close I can get to, uh, to stock basically carbon metallic on what's already on the uh, Corvettes right now. And this is one coat, a very light coat. And this is kind of what it looks like. So in the reviews, I said it, it's more like a charcoal, um, but I haven't, haven't tested it to see what it looks like actually beside um, the other carbon uh, metallic flash bits, like the rear wing and stuff. But I suspect it's gonna be pretty close of a match. So just uh, food for thought if someone's really <clears throat> wanting to do this. Um, it's a cheap alternative to getting it professionally painted. And uh, I think it's gonna be, I think it might be pretty close. So I don't have the car here with me, unfortunately. I'll probably just do another little shoot to see how close of a comparison it is. So I'm gonna put a couple more coats on and, uh, and add it to the video once it's all done and see what it looks like. So I'm about to install the front poverty splitter, uh, painted, painted metallic black stainless from Krylon. Now, getting up real close. Obviously, it's not an exact match, but for off the shelf, for off the shelf, it isn't bad. So once I bolt it on, we'll take a better look from a distance and see what it looks like. And I think it's gonna blend in fairly well. Okay, so this is it. This is what the final product looks like. Now, I don't know if it's gonna show up in the actual video, um, the actual color. So it's not overly sunny today, it's a little overcast. So it kind of gives a better indication of what it kind of looks like as well. So again, I don't know if it's gonna capture some of the metallic Try to get a little closer. Now, if it looks textured, it's because the actual pieces uh, of the splitter and the side skirts are textured. Um, so that's why it might look a little rough, but that's the way it normally is. So again, these aren't clear coated. It's just, uh, just straight uh, Krylon paint. So, I won't get into the whole mounting process of this, but I ended up using uh, two-way tape, uh, Gorilla two-way tape <clears throat> rated higher than 3M. And under here, there's one bolt as well that actually attaches. So it's fairly solid. Um, probably I might redo it and, and maybe add a uh, rivet in the rear. Um, but overall, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it. So if this is something you guys wanted to attempt, to, like now you get an idea of what that may look like instead of going just a straight black. Now, if you notice any kind of like dark blotchy spots, um, uh, it, there was a couple of places I probably could have did a little better. But again, unless you're getting really close, you probably won't notice them. Um, but yeah, very happy with the way it turned out. Uh, so if this is something you guys want to do as a substitute for the actual carbon flash uh, paint, uh, for plastic, uh, go ahead with the Krylon metallic stainless steel. So that's what it looks like. Cheers.